what it is, but they offer to pay you that much for it if you promise not to tell anyone. I promise. And he's on there, so let's end the turn. And I paid that much. A building permit! No thank you! I've got too many of them as it is. Man, I made a good profit though. That flannel fungus just sells like hotcakes. Sleeping masks! I think I could earn more selling them myself. Oh no! Galgums have dropped in quality! Terrible. How can we survive? Sales of sleeping masks. How about we bump the price down to 1,300? That ought to get the ball rolling. Go to the hermit pit. And we'll go to the mine. Sweet! You discovered 59,631 zavels worth of precious stone. Man, why is that mine even closed? There's plenty there still. Not a good time to sell. Nose radios! 150 per nose radio. While tearing up property, build a new larger store. Edifice discovers a watershed on your land. Natural resource finds up netting you 87,000 zables. Wiggle that mustache. Even if you are in last place. Hey, I got it. I didn't even bid that much. The highest blessing possible when Hoffman went and got him more, some more hot water. Neat. Cold furnace in the islands bringing record freezing temperatures. Reports of pipes bursting all over the island. Well, what do you know? Even if I do have three lucky stars. And with three lucky stars, you should go to Myrmidon. Click. Flannel fungus. Gnome burgers. Gnome burgers. 400. Who's selling it? Spinnaker is selling it for 400. Oh man, Snuggots. Gotta buy those first. Those things are a friggin' gold mine. And then the rest can be no burgers. That'll do. Explore with my uh, great blessing. Let's go to the Wuzzy Tunnels. Green jelly and glowing moss hangs from the ceilings. There are singing stalactites and centipedes made of phosphorus. Out of desperation, you grab one of the stinging stalactites and head back out. Sell this musical rock for 50000 to a local nightclub. Cool. I wonder what it was singing. Oop. In the turn. Building permits! No phone. No. Did not get it. Not surprised. Man. 
Oh boy, 400 sh space. A magic sack of laggle crud. Special power to attract customers to your store. Neat. I like magic. I sold half the gnome burgers. And the snugots. Let's see, I think everyone's pretty much undercutting me at the snugots. But they're the demand is so high. Stop hanging. Flannel fungus? Eye caps? I don't know if that information's still up to date. I'm just buying Snugots. Forget it. I know these things sell, and they sell good. Also... Yep, do it. Go for it. I'm employing how many people now? Forty. overhead increases steadily but as long as I keep every both uh, those things up at 100% I'm good oh don't want to skip out on that might as well go to Yaplania building permits Whoa! Man you helped when he was in trouble has passed away, leaving you an inheritance. Maybe he was one of those immigrants. Hundred, almost two hundred thousand zables. Look at me. Three levels. I am fancy. Bolly squash. I'm just gonna sell it. That's a real cheap thing. There were so many Snugots in the uh, store last week. 1,500. Oh man, Briggs really undercut me. And there's still 428 on shelves currently. I want to change the price. Bunions? Wow, that's a lot of bunions for sale. Kind of Gross. <laughs> Quidlicks. I don't really want to buy Quidlicks because it would be giving. Man, he's nearly turned a profit with those. Spy! These clockworms. I'm the only one with clockworms. I'll leave the price as is, and I will buy nostril stuffing. Two thousand, almost three thousand, and one thousand five hundred for nostril stuffing. Yeah, let's just leave it at one thousand five hundred. Then I'm not going to get undercut that badly. Not even. Uh, catacombs? 
Odd-shaped stone pillars and buttresses, but you don't manage to find anything. Aw, but I like finding stuff. Wow, everything's really far away this week. The wind and currents aren't in our favor. Let's go to the Zabel Exchange, then. You can buy some more while the market's low, unless it just rockets up. Secret bids for building permits! Sure. Why not? I'm gonna get outbid anyway. Made a good profit. Oh boy. Reports that the Valhalla have plundered another merchant ship near the lost city of Myrmidon. Surviving members of the crew say these slender giants have simply turned their ship upside down and shook it until all the cargo fell out. That's rude. Gnome burgers, daca meat, sleeping masks, snoople drums, white tonic. Uh, sleeping masks, they were a reliable source of income. Fuzzy tubs are up to 600 in demand. Ooh. I'll just buy some gnome burgers. Eh, let's just buy them all. Go, go, go. Nobody has any. I'm the only one with them in my store. They sold for 800 pretty quick. That's good. That's good. Hmm. Nah. Man, nose radios and heppers just aren't showing up. Curse them. Did I explore this week? No. Come lost inside the catacombs and spend the next two days trying to find your way back out. Fortunately, you succeed! Are you sure I'm lucky? Building permits! Woo! Smitiger seems to believe that Dr. Wuzzy is still alive somewhere inside the Wuzzy Tunnels. I'm the second largest. Man, pretty good selling on those gnome burgers. I didn't get any news at the, uh... Pock stalkers drop in demand! What a tragedy! But hey, the stock market's crashing, so let's buy some shares. Buy low, buy low, sell high. Outer of Indrum? Sure, let's go there. Tons of gnome burgers. Those wally bats are more tempting. Cake thrashers? <laughs> Sounds violent. Sure, let's buy, say, 200 Wally Bats. And then the rest can be more Gnome Burgers. I am the Gnome Burger franchise. I'm the only one that sold them. Wally Bats were selling for 3,000 last time we did this. Let's take a look. The joking tree, huh? You can't stop laughing with its one stump comedy act. You sell the jokes to local comedians for almost a hundred thousand. Must have been a pretty funny tree. Sure. Uh 
Almost done building. Unless something terrible happens. Flannel fungus! Eh, sure. I like flannel fungus. Oh, wow. She bid almost a million on that. Good grief. Oh man, we're fancy now. If you choose to activate the magic crystal rod, you can cast a spell over the island, which will change the demand for nose radios. Yes. Oh no! I wanted it to go up, not down. Those irritating digger weeds seem to be poking up in several parts of the island this week. Even buildings with reinforced concrete foundations can't keep their tough little tendrils from bursting through the floor. Terrible. Insurance. Wally bets. 3,000, 3,600. Ha! Huh, I'm still undercutting you. Fuzzy tubs are really, really in demand. But gnome burgers are more so. Man, those poor gnomes. 800, 900, 900, 600, 600. Don't buy it, Grunion Company. Their gnome burgers are poisoned. Um, sure, go to Mount Bulbous. We're still lucky, right? Yes, we are. And I am full. Yes, all 500 shelf space is taken. Building permits are all filled up. Yee yee! Let's take a poke around. Didn't find anything. Lady Marika Papagika, very rich and compulsive shopper, offers to purchase half the goods in your store for 300,000 zables. Sure. Quagmire and insurance premiums have been lowered an average of 10%. A Doggler's educational program asks you to donate 128,000 Zables to the much-needed scholarship. Well, those Mud Dogglers are in pretty rough shape. Do, 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 every college graduation ever. <laughs> uh... Kind of pricey, but whatever. Wow, solid gold heifers. Lucky you. Shelves are half empty. Mostly thanks to me selling stuff. Whoa! I'm in last, but just barely. Oh no, the quality of jitters has been deteriorating. Terrible. You should go to there. And I want to go here. Ow. Uh, six days of wandering through the never-ending labyrinth, you begin to hallucinate. You imagine your feet are made of ice and quickly melting in the intense heat. Then you see clear gelatinous worms sprouting from the pores of your nose. In a fit of hysteria, you dash back to the surface. Next few weeks, you wind up spending 66,000 zables in a dream awareness session trying to rid yourself of these nightmares. Well, that could have gone better. Could have gone better. Grunion is never going to turn a profit with flannel fungus.